first, though, for more than 40 years, Sesame Street's Bert and Ernie have entertained us and like a felt covered odd couple. But once again, there is speculation that they are, in fact, a couple. Now, I first pretend to be something, and you have to guess what it is that I'm pretending to be. Well, if you ask Mark Saltzman, who wrote Bert and Ernie sketches for 15 years on Sesame Street, it's time we all stop pretending. They're gay, accept it, and move on. In a recent interview, Saltzman admitted that he always wrote them as a loving gay couple, based partly on his own relationship with his same-sex partner, Arnie. Not that speculation hasn't come up before, including on this network. Some think those double beds should be pushed together. Some even suggest they should move up here to Canada so their love can be legally recognized. That was from 2011, when a petition to let them get married swept the Internet. At the time, Sesame Workshop said, nope, just friends. Then two years later, they appeared, looking very much like a couple, on a New Yorker cover, just as the U.S. Supreme Court ruled that same-sex couples should get full couples' benefits. Oh, nice, Bert. Now, maybe Sesame Workshop simply reads the characters differently, or it's just trying to stay out of the culture wars. But again, today, it said, no, they're not gay. Even though they're identified as male characters and possess many human traits, they remain puppets and do not have a sexual orientation, to which many people People say, yeah, right, whatever you say, guys. Who oh, I go on for hours, I get a joyous feeling.